Hey everyone, this is Martin from howtomakemobilegames.com on July the 9th, 2016, Saturday here in Shanghai, China and uh, evening time almost 8pm. This video is about adding promo videos to your games on the app stores uh, that you're publishing on. So that would be like say Apple App Store, Google Play or the Amazon App Store. Uh, this is just a quick report on how it's gone for us this past few days. So, or past couple of weeks. So, uh, as you may or may not know, you can, since like last year, you can add like promo videos, which is like a short preview video to your games on the iPhone App Store, Google Play, and also Amazon as well. I think um, Google Play has been around for a couple of years doing that actually, and uh, iOS only started this, I think, last year, 2015. So we've been adding ours for a couple of weeks now, and the one that, I, that I've been tracking personally through the account that I watch uh, is this U Escape Sometimes 2 game. Uh, I don't have a lot of other data at the moment because I, I did add to this one, but the other two videos, the other two games that I added videos to, one gets very low downloads anyway, and I didn't do A-B testing, I just added the video, I forgot to do an A-B test. Uh, and the second game, actually, as soon as I added the video, Google Play went and suspended the game because it's got some, uh, uh, in the background, it's got like Ferrari car pictures. And obviously, they, they, you're not supposed to do that, even though the picture itself is public domain. It's a public domain picture that anyone can use. But I guess they're just worried because, you know, Ferrari might call them or something. So I've got to adjust the screenshots to fix that. But so this one, uh, this is the one you escape sometimes too. And here's the results so far. Um, the promo video is the blue line, and the current version, which has no promo video, is the gray line. Uh, every now and then, the gray line, the non-promo, seems to get more downloads, but the promo video overall is getting more downloads. Um, this day here was a little bit different. There was a bit of a gap. So, as you can see here, the current installs 275 and the scaled installs 550. So that means that uh, the number of installs that the player has kept the game, the number of players that have kept the game on their device is slightly higher for the promo video. Um, and uh, the scaled installs, well, it's going to be just times by 50% because it's half and half. Half of the audience is seeing the game page without a video and half of the audience is seeing a game page with the video. So that's why you have this scaled install here. So... Yesterday I was going to do this, and or, or a few days ago, I was going to do this video and say, yeah, adding a promo video does have an impact. It does, yes. I would say adding a promo video to any game that you have on any store is very good. Um, I found it to be um, easier to create a video which looks more interesting than screenshots. And also I've read reports from companies like Chartboost that say adding a promo video increases like the number of downloads that you can get by like, I don't know, 20% or something. I can't remember the exact number, but it's a definite impact. So uh, obviously it depends, like if you do bad screenshots, you don't get good downloads. If you do a bad video, you're not going to get good downloads. So it really depends on the quality of the video. The other thing here as well, guys, is that if you're getting very low downloads already, we're talking like 10 a day, which is not uncommon for most small indie developers. If you're only getting 10 downloads a day, then you won't see a big impact anyway because uh, you just the, the, there's not enough data, basically. Say like yesterday you got 10 on, you had a video and today you got 11 or 12. You're not really going to be able to tell because each day goes up and down slightly. Uh, even this one here, this game, you escape sometimes too. Um, we're only getting like uh, how many downloads a day? Uh, over 100 back here, you know, lower here. So between 100 and 120 on average, but still it's kind of hard to tell where the impact actually came. Um, plus the other reason is if you look at Chartboost like, to show, look at the down.